What do you mean? As in, what did, as were you surprised that they figured him out so quickly? And then he, because for me, it was really um, not upsetting, but it was a bit like, oh man, like I kind of wanted to see more of him. Like he was something that was a bit unique and exciting. Yeah. And I feel like, you know, he got figured out early. I mean, would, do you think the same would have happened to Murley if, if, if Murley bowled in today's game? Do you think it would have been the same for him? Or do you just think he was that good? I think Murley was that good. The fact that he's got 700 test wickets, that's. That tells you that paints the picture, right? But <laughs> yeah, I can, it... you're having none of it. I can tell you. No, I'm having none of it. it. Murley will still be <laughs> taking wickets now. 100%. You know what actually really annoys me? Um, I'll talk about this while she comes back. Is um, that lots of people they they always put Shane Warne in as their spinner in their all-time teams. Mm-hmm. And I understand that as a leg spinner and the way he bowls is quite. Uh, it's orthodox the way he bowls, right? In terms of okay, so the way. He bowls looks very good. Maybe it potentially looks better than the way Murley bowls, right? But in terms of like volume of work, and if you look at as you said, seven hundred wickets for Murley, like Murley's got to be in there. Like he is the best spinner of all time. And anyone who says that Shane Warne is, like you got to go and look at the record books, man, because Shane Warne is one hundred percent. He's up there. And I think if you want to say, look, maybe your all time. Like I think maybe we did when we did the, uh, what was it? We did uh, the Anderson thing, didn't we? And we said, look, is Anderson up there as one of the greats? And we said, actually, McGraw, is, we rate more, even though he's got less wickets. But I feel like with spinners, I feel like it's different because I feel like Murray had just as much skill as Warren, if not more, because of his variations. So I feel like it's a bit harsh to say, you know what, Shane Warren, is, he can be your favourite spinner, but I don't think you can say he's the best spinner of all time. Like if Murray's got those stats and he's bowled that well, then surely, I just don't think he's talked about enough. I mean, if you... I agree. Basically, I, I, I just my two cents on that is Murley is a sh- more is more of a shyer person, so he yeah. doesn't come into the coverage as much. Therefore, everyone concentrates on Shane Warren, and Shane Warren has a hundred less wickets than him basically right? <laughs> in Test matches. Shane Warren was away for a while, then he came back. Blah blah blah. blah. It's the same thing, like. Murli Dharan is a much better bowler ODI test. Shane Warren gave up uh, ODIs when he was on like 250 wickets or something like that. Right? Yeah. Murli Dharan is a better and more complete bowler yeah. because they, they couldn't really pick him even at the end. Shane Warren just spun it big. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, I agree. Interesting. I, Interesting. No, no, I, I was actually going to mention that. That's a really good point, Ashton, about the media coverage because yeah. Shane Warren obviously is he's <laughs> clearly not shy. And look, he's yeah. no fault of his own. He's, he's doing what he li- likes and loves, right? He's obviously, we hear him a lot on uh, doing commentary. You know, Usher, do you love him? Uh, doing the commentary, etc. And, you know, as a leg spinner, he's quite good to listen to. And he's, yeah. you know, he's quite an exciting person to listen to as well. But I think maybe because they talk about him a lot, uh, as Venu said, and, and you've said as well, rightly so, that he really is quite shy. And maybe he is not that kind of, I don't want to say he's that he's not as welcoming a present, uh, a present. Sorry, he. I think he is. I just don't think he likes the limelight as much. So maybe I don't think he funny. likes the limelight at all. Yeah. He's a very humble person, from what I. Well, it's like I know him. Yeah, <laughs> but he <laughs> seems like a very humble person. Therefore, yeah. he doesn't like to be in the limelight. Even now, he's he's an assistant coach in yeah. IPL for one of the teams, and he doesn't like to come in front of the camera as much. But Shane Warren does. Yeah, true. So he does. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's interesting, though. And also yeah. the point that has to be made that if you think about the team Shane Warren played for in the test um, team for Australia, it was probably one of the best um, eras of Australian test cricket. So he was in, he was in a better team for sure, um, for Shane Warren. But Murali, he wasn't, you know, Sri Lanka were in a good... Um, had a good lineup. I'm um, doing, especially his latter part of his, well, they of his did. career. They, they had Vars and uh, uh Joe Ward and Asangakara. Uh, yeah, true. Yeah. But bowling wise, didn't have as much as Australia did. Exactly. So, hey, you had Sanajan yeah. Surya, okay? Yeah, in, yeah. In the early 2000s. Yeah, Chimin Devas. Yeah, Chimin quality. His quality. Right, okay. No, yeah, no, I agree. I think late 90s Sri Lanka was amazing. Oh my no, god. I agree. Yeah, it was good. But, yeah. yeah. To start two silver, cents on that. Oh, 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 oh. Sorry, just start, yeah. Just yeah. our two cents on Murley. Uh, yeah. 
I think he's great. So if he's watching this, which you won't be, but we love you, Morley. We love you. But Shane, will we love you as well, but not as much. Maybe not as much. We'll see. <laughs> no, it's a lot of fun. So thank you very much, guys, for that as well. And uh, if you guys at home disagree, then please let me know what you disagree on. And if you do disagree, you're wrong. We are right. But otherwise, thank you very much. No, I'm joking. <laughs> please let me know. Um, and what and why you think. I hope you have a great rest of the day and week. And yeah, catch you on the next video.